Oh boy, are you guys in for a treat. I've been waiting to do this video for some time now. Today we're going to talk about the STP high pressure turbo upgrade for C15 A certs. Stay tuned. <laughs> Alright guys, if you found this video or if you clicked on this video, you're probably aware that a lot of people use the SDP's high pressure turbo on their BXS, MXS, and NXS engines as an upgrade. Um, the SDP is the 2008, 2009, and 2010 C15 Acer, um, whereas the BXS, MXS, and NXS would be 2007 to late 2004. Here you can see I have a replacement turbo, replacement high pressure turbo for the older A-certs, the pre-emissions BXS, MXS, NXS. Here I have the SDP high pressure turbo. And granted, the big difference right off the bat, your SDP is a ball bearing turbo versus a journal bearing design. On top of that, the SDP also has a slightly larger compressor wheel inducer size. They're both a 94 millimeter wheel overall but the SDP has a 70 millimeter inducer versus the 62 millimeter inducer on the older models. This coupled with ball bearing and a smaller 144 exhaust housing, the SDP turbo spools up quite a bit faster and is almost a bolt on upgrade. Almost, not quite. Let's show the differences of why it's not exactly an upgrade that can be directly bolted on, but it is very close and it's something you can do and we have a couple parts that might help you out with that. One of the easiest ways to tell the difference between the older BXS, MXS, and NXS high pressure versus the SDP high pressure is to look for these air cooling fins you'll see on the center cartridge. The air cooling fins let you know that this is a ball bearing cartridge and in fact an SDP high pressure turbo. Aside from the different wheels, they do have different size exhaust housings. This, the SDP comes with a slightly smaller 144 versus the high pressure, which I believe is a 158, but please don't quote me. But as far as bolt up, uh, these exhaust flanges are going to be the same, along with the flanges that bolt to your manifold. All right, guys, what really stands in the way between you bolting an SDP high pressure turbo up on your older Acer truck is this compressor discharge flange. So basically, this is where it's going um, up into the pre-cooler. Um, you can see that you have a V-band versus this slip joint. And you might say, hey, why don't you just switch the compressor covers? But don't forget, this is a 62 millimeter inducer versus a 70 millimeter inducer. So you can't just switch the covers. So we've come up with an option. We have got a custom compressor cover that will accept the 70 millimeter wheel inducer and it has this slip joint. So basically we can sell you just the cover or we can sell it to you with a cartridge and then you would just put it into an SDP turbine housing and now you have a bolt on upgrade for the SDP high pressure turbo for your older Acer. All right, so we covered the difference between the SDP and the MXS, BXS and NXS high pressure. Man, that's really a mouthful to say. And if you haven't noticed already, the SDP turbo here that we have is a core turbo. That's why it's a little rusty and beat up. So naturally the new turbo does look a lot better. So we wanted to introduce our new super core. And like I said, you can buy this as a super core with a genuine Garrett SDP high pressure cartridge in it. And it already has the compressor cover you need for it to be a direct swap on your MXS, BXS, and NXS truck. You would just go ahead and get an SDP turbine housing. And you can do that by either buying a whole core turbo or just buying the housing and then you have a complete turbo ready to go. The benefit of doing over that, instead of just buying an SDP turbo, is that then you'd be responsible for a core and you wouldn't have one and the whole nine. Very complicated and expensive. If you have an SDP truck and you're just looking for replacement turbos, we can just sell you a high pressure cartridge or low pressure cartridge. We do carry the genuine ball bearing cartridges in stock. That way you're getting a new turbo opposed to buying a reman or whatnot or things like that. So guys, if you have any questions about the differences in the SDP and the MXS high pressures, uh, if you have any questions about the super core and how that would work on your truck, please feel free, give us a call, shoot us a text, email, leave them in the comments below. Uh, we do have these in stock, we're really excited. And like I said, we have the cartridges, we have the super core, and we have just the housing if that's the way that you wanna go. Guys, thanks so much for watching, stay tuned for the next one. Really enjoying doing these. If there's anything you'd like to know about big truck turbos and you want us to do a video, leave it in the comments below. Thanks guys. Take care.